here and today's game is going to be Academia School Simulator. So let's begin with the new game. So I'm going to randomize everything, doing it three times. So let's do one, two, three. Hoover Lake. Okay. One, two, three. Okay. Um, flag. Um, let's do. Oh, it's in. Uh, alphabetical order, so let's do actually uh, Germany. There we go. And then randomize one, two, three. Okay, so in slaughter. Sergeant Inslaughter was a former drill sergeant at the military academy. After receiving an honorable discharge, she chose to bring her skills to the academy. Uh, I think that was supposed to be with the Y at the end. She rose with an iron fist, meaning most students will straighten out very quickly. However, her methods rub kind-hearted counselors and teachers the wrong way. Okay, let's play. Okay. Okay, build face. Okay, so there was a thing up here for um, government grants. Like if you built a cafeteria and kitchen, you get money and stuff. But I don't see that here anymore. So I guess that may have been taken out of the game. Let's see. Okay, this. For now, I'm going to do a um, blueprint. Because what I want to do is try to create my old school, kinda, as close as I can. Um, So I'm going to start with walling this part off. Okay, and then we're going to leave a little space there. And here I'm going to... Here, let's erase that. Um, because... You have to be super careful with spending. Um, I'm doing the wall and everything first. Um, actually, let's do like so. And this is going to be the kitchen area. That way, it, they can go straight out to delivery and garbage. Um, There we go. Uh, let's do a little bit larger for the cafeteria. Like so. Okay, and this area is going to be the room for the staff, the staff room. That wasn't part of, was not part of my school, but I'm going to add it here anyway, so the workers have a place to, uh, one will be the cafeteria, the other is going to be the uh, lounge room. Okay, is there a way to, yeah, zones, here we go. Unfortunately, so much of it is closed off, um, locked I mean including the toilets. Um, let's do, continue with the blueprint uh, though. So at my school, right beside it, the 
auditorium like the theater. So I'll do that here and I'll turn this one in the game into um, like the what's it called? Special rooms there is the uh, activity hall. I would turn that into the activity hall because I don't think they have a theater here in this game. So that's what that'll be. And at my school across the hall was the office uh, blocks, the front office. And there are a lot of them, so I'll do, just do a um, do it that way. And from here is the front entrance. Um, hmm. Let's go ahead and do another entrance over here because the bus area was beside the cafeteria. But because I added these to the thing for the uh, staff members, I will do another thing over here for the entrance. Have this as the bus stop. Okay, let's do okay that's also a lot okay um, best stop is going to be over here and that might you know what I can do is make an entrance here going into the cafeteria because we had a large um, patio area at my school so I can make one of those. And the entrance to the cafeteria was over here. And then up here is the hallway going to this way. So that's what I'll do. Okay, so. I wonder if there's like a band thing here probably not but music room actually that'll be the band hall which was right in here and that one was pretty large too along with the locker rooms for the instruments I'll do that for the band hall um and do something like that maybe yeah it's not looking at all like my school now because um, beside that was another room for the theater students like the room for practicing was there and then the art uh, the theater is way over here. I didn't make it as large though for the game because there is no point in doing that. Let's just say it's going to be a, what's it called? Uh, I'm trying to think of the words and phrases, but um, not based off of my school, but inspired by the school. That's a good way to put it. Now over here is going to be the patio with some tables and maybe that can also be a um, common area. I don't know if maybe I can do that outside or not, um, but I'll try to see. Okay, so the 
let's do something like that and we did have double doors right there going into the rest of the school okay let me think we had classrooms this way now let's do restrooms first um, we had two of them over here like so and then two more over this side to do it along with that the home ec room was right here I'll put some kind of special room there I don't know what though um, maybe the AV room um, no I'll do something else there because the AV room I'm going to put as my old AutoCAD class which was right beside it, like so. Then from there, there is a library right there. Do that. Connect these like so. Maybe have vending machines there um, or something. Let's see. Um, Let's go ahead and do something along this way. Beside the library was the gym, so I can make something there maybe. Okay, there we go. And then we had three long hallways going this way. Um, side by side which had all the classrooms down it I can do classrooms for maybe each of the grades going that way but let's go ahead and okay do that something along that line I guess Um, so we had the hallway, actually let's make that smaller, okay that looks better, and each side hide classrooms, so I'll go ahead and do that. Um, Let's do two of each. Although I may go ahead and make these into. No, let's do that. Okay, each one of these can be a different grade. And then over the years, I can create a new. Um, set of hallways with the um, new classrooms yeah that's what I'll do maybe make this one into something uh, same goes for that maybe a, one of the special rooms okay so um, Let's go ahead and figure out the things here. Um, I 
They don't even need a large space though uh, for the offices. Okay, let's do objects. There we go. Okay, one thing we can do, get rid of all of these, that'll give me extra money. quick door right here so they can get through I can always add these back later on if I need to or want to That's the quickest way for getting money this in this game. Oh, I was doing it wrong, I guess. Good to know. It's the end of the day, so I'll go ahead and continue doing all of these so they can start on it the following day. Okay. Hope that helps a little bit at least. I think I, yeah, I already made it to where that deleted, but oh well. Let's fast forward. Yep, see? I'll get those back. Um, 
you know, it's not a big deal because I can add on to it later. I just need this one for now. And maybe the accountant's um, office. Yeah. Let's do the accountant one and then. Um, and then do the research for accountant. Let's delete these for now. I can add those back later. Um, do the same for that to save money. Um, there we go. Okay, let them finish that up. <clears throat> I do need the floor though. Okay, there we go. I may need to do a bank loan though. Now let's do research. No, I need to grab a principal first. So let's do that like so. Oh, I need to duh, do the blueprints. There we go. Now, uh, definitely need that. That unlocks the bathroom, toilets. I mean the bathroom, cafeteria, stuff like that. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. Research. And... Money manager. There we go. Now let's do accountant. There we go. Um, next is the classrooms. And I'll add on to it. Uh oh. Let's do. Oh, I cannot do that one. Okay, then. <coughs> Probably end up running out of money, too. Okay, 
there we go. Now do... Um, classroom. Um, let's see. Do that. Still need to hire teachers too. Those are expensive, like three thousand each. And I need like maybe seven of them. Let's do admissions real quick. There we go. need 15 of them for now okay there we go Just counting these real quick in my head. Okay. Okay, there's that. That's all I need for now in order to get these working. Um now I need teachers. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I need six. Um, take a look and see. Put him as the language. Um, He can be... No, no one can be math because I'm out of money. And I cannot take it out a new loan. Let's do that. Hope for the best. Okay, so now I can do another teacher. Okay, that would be good for math. Now science. Actually, let's do history. I cannot. Um, cannot afford any more teachers. So I'm going to go ahead and why does that one have two teachers?
Mm. Oh well. Okay, so I'm going to end the episode here and hope for a better outcome next time. See you later. Bye.